I thought I heard the old man say Just out of interest, what kind of music were they singing? The rock and roll of 1752. I manage bands and I'm interested in representing you. You've got a unique sound and we believe we can help you get it released by a major label. <laughs> I'm serious. Jago said there may be room at the inn. Mum, Natasha's at the door. I'm coming. Sorry I'm late. Freshman don't wear green. Anything else? Never say the word rabbit. Rabbit? What I don't understand is why anyone would want to part with a hard-earned cash to buy a record sung by ten freshmen. Your songs transport the listener to distant shores. Your wake-up call. Sally reckons he's a proper big shot. Rubber big mouth, more like. No charge for the wake-up call, then. All part of the service. I want to mention it in my TripAdvisor review. If we did agree to let you manage us, you'd have to understand that our real work comes first. I'll give you my word. Okay, chin out, chin down. Which one? <laughs> Hello, Danny. I've got a TV show that are looking for someone to sing the national anthem for the Queen's birthday. I can't believe they're up to a million hits. Nobody wants to be the man who missed out on signing the Beatles. And what about missing out on life in the meantime? To old friends and you. Remember what the well-known Irish singer said, I may be plain old Paul Euston from Dublin, but a pair of shades on. I'm Bonio. <laughs> Bono, you pillock. And